MT Connect provides us better collaboration, more communication, and faster execution. Hi, I'm Mark Albert, Editor-in-Chief of Modern Machine Shop Magazine, and I'm here at ITAMCO, Indiana Technology and Manufacturing Companies in Plymouth, Indiana, and I'm here with Joel Nydick, the Technology Manager for ITAMCO. Joel, tell me a little bit about ITAMCO. What kind of company is it? What do you do here? Well, ITAMCO started in 1955, and basically we do uh, large machine uh, components for large OEMs, very high precision, and basically we do anything from milling and turning to grinding, uh, and we do about 50% of our work is gear manufacturing. A lot of our components get splines or gear teeth on them. Joel, tell me a little bit about Empty Connect. What is it exactly, and how has it helped ITAMCO? Uh, basically, MT Connect's an open source, royalty-free standard that enables you to connect to your different machine tools, and we, so we have quite a variety here. We have 30 different types of machine tools and controls, and over 200 all together between our two facilities in Argus and Plymouth, Indiana. What's MT Connect? Why is that different? How does that make this a a new opportunity for you? Well, I think it all comes down to the fact that is the correlation that MT Connect can bring. It's, you know, it can connect to your ERP system. It can connect to your, uh, your quality management system, you know, your data collection systems that you have, um, you know, scheduling, uh, utilization, of, you know, your machine monitoring, basically, uh, communication with ma your maintenance department, you know, seeing when a machine goes down or not. So I think MT Connect brings that correlation, whereas, you know, if you have a proprietary software that, you know, they might not be able to connect to that machine yeah. tool or there's not the ability to do, to, do so, there is a way with MT Connect. It's exactly what our company needed. Uh, we were looking for a machine monitoring solution and not having to go with a proprietary software, we were able to go with this open source protocol and then go out and choose whatever application suited us best. Since MT Connect is just a protocol, uh, we have to start with some, some sort of application that's going to take advantage of the data in that format. Right. Let's step back and talk a little bit about sure. that. Right now we're using ShopViz, which is made by TechSolve, and it's a machine monitoring application that we're able, it's web-based and we're able to you know, basically connect to the MT Connect streams that are being produced by our MT Connect agents. Here at ITAMCO, we use ShopViz software to help analyze our MT Connect data. Um, while going through the data, I've discovered a problem on one of our lays where it shows a spindle override at 80% and feed rate at 70, so I'm going to go investigate that. So any machine with an agent that's turning internal data into the empty connect format can go right into ShopViz? Exactly. Okay, but even basic machine monitoring is a real valuable? Oh yeah, basic machine monitoring is huge. Uh, utilization, it's faster to run it on this machine than that machine yeah. in comparing the two. We've also started looking at energy as another application. Well, right now you've got a shop full of machines that have, uh, they're not all brand new. That's right. So how, how do you implement MT Connect on a machine that's already on your shop floor? What do you have to do? And so what you use in that matter is using a hardware adapter, and sometimes it requires a software adapter on these legacy machines because, let's face it, some of these machines have serial ports or you know they don't have an ethernet connection that you can just plug it right into your network. So you need some type of hardware adapter to give the ability to get that information out. And we're using power monitors, uh, hall effectors, you know, amp probes, um, you know, just basic you know, energy monitoring. And you can, you can see utilization, basically your cycle start, your cycle on, based on a threshold that you set on that machine. And we're also using small PLCs that have ethernet connections on them that you tap into the different IO of the machine to get that information like cycle on, um, is, there, is there an alarm? And it's not as discreet as the new machine tools, but it is data enough that you can gather to get that information out. What we have here is one of our shot peening machines. It's a very simple machine. Um, we're using an Atom adapter, MT Connect adap hardware adapter that's a PLC IO adapter. We can monitor the motors on this machine and the airs that we have on the machine remotely. And this is a simple machine that basically cleans parts. 
So one of the things MT Connect has propelled our company to do is invent new technologies like iBlue. And what you can do with it is check temperature, metal hardness, and the measurement of your part all in one portable wireless device. Um, one thing I, I did is I open source an iPhone app that's an empty connect client that you can basically check your machine status uh, in your plant and it doesn't require any extra software other than an adapter and an agent in your machine tool. I have an iPhone app that uses MT Connect to constantly let me monitor all my machines, whether in the shop or at home, 24 hours a day. Joe, you've shown us many ways that Empty Connect and Empty Connect enabled applications have helped you here at ITAMCO. It seems that a machine shop of any size could benefit from Empty Connect and these applications. Would you agree with that? Yeah, I'd agree with that. I mean, any, even the small shop with one or two machine tools could benefit from, you know, utilization or machine monitoring or, you know, when they're away at home, they want to view their machine tools and in action and, you know, kind of an unattended state. I think it could work for just a small shop, even to the, you know, the 100 machine tool shop. And MT Connect involves some investment and some, uh, some effort, but it doesn't look like that would be on the scope of uh, most machine shops. No, I think, I think a small machine shop could, for a relatively low price, be able to implement MT Connect in their shop. When investing in capital equipment, MT Connect helps you maximize that investment.